Hey everyone and welcome to Isms by Josie. Today we're going to be doing part four of our video series with Roslyn and I've got my two remaining nails that I still have to decorate for you guys. For my returning subscribers, thank you so much for tuning in and for my new viewers, please consider subscribing, share, hit that like button, leave a comment below and click on that notification bell for future videos. For our last um, part in this series, I'm going to be doing a marble design. I love this black and yellow collection kit. I'm going to leave the product link in the description box below, along with the discount code that is good until the end of July. But I'm using this C013 as the background, and for the other nail, I'm going to use this one. It's C001. And um, we're going to do a flip-flop with the colors. Um, one side's going to be light, the other side's going to be dark. It's pretty much what I've been doing in my previous videos for this series. If you haven't catched them, go and check those out after this one. But again, I really love this collection. It's my favorite so far that I have um, received from Roslyn. And um, it's just got some really play of colors. It's it's mostly glitters and shimmer, um, aside from the black and the white. So um, I could see myself using these colors separately um, with other designs. So now for the next step, I'm using um, this C206. And we're going to be starting with the black nail. So I'm going to put on some of that white. And then this um, C026 uh, that I just showed you. And then we have this C027. And this one is probably my favorite out of the group. It's a shimmery gold. And I'm just going to be putting a simple line there. And then we have the um, C167. This is the black with the silver glitter flecks in it and then of course we have our gold chunky glitter C295 and we're going to be putting a little strip of this so I'm going to zoom in on this you guys I'm going to use my ball tool any size and I'm just going to run it through back and forth mixing it up marbling it on this little um, resin palette it looks so nice. It's like an ASMR moment here. And then once I do that, I am going to take my um, marbling brush and I'm going to scoop up a strip of this. The messier, the better. And I'm just going to start in one corner, work my way down on an angle. And I'm just going to keep layering this stuff next to each other until I get it to where I want it. And that's pretty much it. And because these are glitters, um, it's really hard to see the marbling in it. So I'm going to go back in. I'm using these um, little splotches here. We've got some. I'm going to use the white and the black. Or it's not black. It's like, I think it's the black with the flex. I don't know. Anyway. Um, I'm just going to swirl the brush. The longer the bristles, the better, because that means less control over what you're doing. And I think when this bristle just goes everywhere and makes its own moments, I think it ends up making um, a better marbling. But yeah, it's starting to look super pretty. Okay, so after I cured that, I'm just going to um, line the border with this shimmery gold. And normally I would probably do like that chrome powder, but since we have these beautiful glitters, I'm going to be using that shimmery gold one. So now for the next nail, um, I'm going to lay down some colors uh, that will work with the white background. So um, I'm using that C013, the black, and then I'm going to use the glitters. And again, I'm just going to take my ball tool and I'm going to um, brush this up and down through these lines, creating a marble. 
in it's a fuzzy close up but <laughs> close up nonetheless to give you that view of me doing that and then i got my marbling brush to pick it up and again i'm going to start in one corner and work my way down in an angle and put them next to each other until i um put it where i want it and because it's kind of mulled out because this is darker uh, marbling now i'm going to try to do the same thing um And I'm just going to be marbling this gold chunky glitter on there. I love the look that it gives with those chunky glitters. And then, um, of course, we have those other. This is the black with the silver flex. And in the naked eye, you can see the differences of these glitters marbled in this space. But I feel that the uh the video is washing it out so hopefully at the end when i show you the end results with ho better lighting hopefully you'll be able to pick up all the different marbly colors on there so after curing that again i'm going to be using that shimmery gold to border the marble and give it that extra look and here's the end result you guys we're going to do a far away and then close up and then um and then like the nails against my hand so you can see uh it kind of looks better against my hand than it does in this black background but yeah again if you like this kit you guys go check it out i'll leave the product link in the description box below along with the discount code that is valid to the end of july this is by far my favorite kit that i've uh, received from rosalind so thank you so much for watching, you guys. This is Ism Spy Josie. Please share, like, and subscribe for future videos. And join me again Saturday night. I have night at the improv. And then come Thursday, I do have worldly Josieisms. Who knows? I might throw in an extra video. We'll see. But yeah, so you can see the um, all that marbling swirl. I love it. And it gives me like the, the, the tiger um, stone or I don't know what they call it, but um, it's very stripey and it has like those tiger colors. But this is what I'm talking about. Doesn't it just pop more if it's against your skin? It's weird. At any rate, I'll see you again next time. Thanks. Bye.